Immune therapy, unlike chemotherapy and targeted therapy, is really our third type of treatment uh, for lung cancer. Chemotherapy affects general processes by which uh, cells divide and goes after the cancer cells. Targeted therapies affect, affect unique vulnerabilities in the cancer cells themselves and, and is a way by which they work. Immune therapies actually don't target the tumor cells at all. They try to reactivate the immune system. So when you develop a cold, your immune system uh, uh, develops a response and fights against that cold. When you develop cancer, in many instances, the immune system is trying to fight against the cancer, but the cancer sends signals to the immune system uh, to put the brakes on it and hence not to go after the tumor. And what immune therapy is, is to sort of, is, is our, our treatments uh, that take the brakes off the immune system, reactivate the immune system to then go after the cancer. Uh, and this has turned out to be a very effective uh, strategy. Uh, these are um, now uh, approved therapies uh, for lung cancers uh, and are used uh, in some instances as the first treatment for advanced lung cancer or in some instances as the subsequent treatment for lung cancer. And similar to targeted therapy, uh, you need to test the tumor uh, for this specific signal, what we call PDL1, the protein that the tumor cells send out, to see if the patient is a potential candidate uh, for uh, immune therapy, uh, just like you test uh, cancers to see if the patient is a potential candidate uh, for targeted therapy.